Hey, this is Andrew Brown from Exam Pro, and we're looking at organizations and accounts. So when you first sign up for AWS, you um, are creating a single account, and that first user you're logging in as is the root user, okay? So just look over here on this diagram, see where we have a master account. So just uh, let's pretend that this was the account that we created, and we are logging in as that root account user. So what you can do is you can promote your account into an organization, uh, and so what that, that's going to allow you to do is it's going to allow you to create multiple accounts within that organization. So now that original account is now a master account and underneath it, it you can create multiple accounts, okay? So why would you wanna do this? Well, if you're uh, uh, an organization, you might want to like uh, uh, isolate uh, different departments uh, within your company uh, and also to have fine-tuned control over what they have access to on mass, okay? So the idea here is like, let's say you have a development team on one side and there's multiple accounts. You can put them within an organizational unit and then use a service control policy to apply rules about what services they can and cannot use uh, on mass, okay? So, I mean, that's pretty much all there is to it, but I think this will be a lot more clear when we do a quick follow along, okay?